Hey, I saw you giggling when you saw um, Evelyn. Was Arabla in the picture? <laughs> In other news, a drive through town reveals the hoisting of political party flags and billboards. And that a strong signal campaigning has been stepped up and that election is in the corner. Evelyn Tingma has been finding out if indeed the showcasing of flags and billboards do really matter. Call it the battle of the flags and you will not be far from it. They add glamour to the campaign and create awareness that an election is pending. A senior political science lecturer at the University of Ghana says outdoor advertisement helps reduce invalid votes. The other advantage of having the flyers and then the banners and all that is that this, it makes the electorate to be aware of the candidates they want to vote for. People may not even identify with the symbols, they may not identify with uh, the logos, but they can identify the faces of the candidates they want to vote for. You may not be wrong to say the battle is just between two parties, as the NDC and MPP flags and billboards are most visible, and one wonders where the others are. So we ask, could that be the reason the smaller parties do not win elections? If you look at the different manifestos of the major parties and then the smaller parties, there's nothing very significant, radically different, that these smaller parties are bringing to the table. And that is why they are not really catching our attention. The other problem they have is with funds. Then, organization at the district regional level. Unlike in previous elections, where the two dominant parties, NDC and MPP, mounted giant billboards, this year seemed different. The NDC appears more visible. So, have strategies to reach out to the electorate changed? Billboards are very, very expensive to mount. So, in terms of cost consideration, I think they want to reduce significantly the costs involved in uh, running these elections and so that they could uh, really uh, better target this money into other campaign strategies for example providing more t-shirts for example providing more uh, souvenir for the uh, people very very important and that is very captivating well dr abdullah kuyini mohammed says elections are about numbers and the presence of party flags gives psychological satisfaction but Will that translate into more followers and votes for the political parties? Evelyn Tengma, TV3 News.